Sean, if someone had said to me, Chantal, we're going to sign a striker, I would not have thought of you. So, Bain, you Notts, Not Nottingham boy at Notts County. So what's brought you back here? Um, first and foremost, um, I'm, I'm delighted to be here. Um, what brought me back was a conversation I had with Russ and the people at this football club um, and, and the position they're in. I was just more than happy to um, take on their offer and hopefully do my best and shoot us back up that league. So was there an element of goodwill from the year you were here before that's had an overhang to now? Um, obviously, uh, Russ was the, the youth team coach then and um, he, he, he must have seen something in me that he, he thinks that he needs now and you know he's, he's going to bring one or two in and, and hopefully push us over that line and um, I'm just really excited um, to be here to be honest. Um, not played enough games this season. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about this one again. So two and a half years since you were here last, for people who don't have encyclopedic knowledge, where have you played? Well, I, I obviously I was, I was back at Bury um, for half a season and then um, my little boy was, was born in, in the February so I, I moved back home to, to Elverton until the end of the season. And then I found myself at Notts County, which you know, um, which was my hometown club. Started really well for me and um, scored scored goals when I played. But ever since I signed um, my new deal, it, it, it didn't work out, and I, I wasn't given that opportunity. So it was a, a no-brainer for me to to come and um, you know help help this club move up the, up the league. How sharp do you feel? Um, obviously. Um, I feel good in myself. Um, I've looked after myself, but there's there's nothing um, more important than games, and and hopefully, as the games go on, I'll I'll, I'll feel stronger. Obviously, you'll have seen Matt Sparrow has been brought in today. There's a centre half coming as well. There's a lot of experience in th in the three of you, and that's I'm sure the message that Russell's given you is that he wants you to steer the side. Yeah, obviously, um, I've I've been in this position at Northampton, believe it or not. Um, two or three years ago and um, it, it's testing times but it, it's like ourself, it's people like ourselves with that experience to, to pull the lads together they seem a, a close knit group and um, I, I think we'll, we'll call upon that to, to pull us through and the thing is you know the level really well don't you yeah definitely I've played most of my career throughout this, this league and um, there's, there's certainly nothing to be afraid of um, everybody needs to stay calm and and, and try and enjoy the football. I know it's difficult, but um, I'm sure we'll come good. Uh, with people like Wes Burns and, and Elliot Richards in the side, do you think that, that the potential service is there for you to, to score the goals you want? Well, obviously, I, I'd like to think so. I haven't, I haven't seen much of Charlton this season, if I'm being honest, but um, I've, I've heard they've got a lot of pace, and if they can put that in the right areas, you, you know I'll be on the end of them. So um, that's, that's my, my, my aim. And 48 hours in, until your first game, it, it, it's a question of just trying to work out who's who and that type of thing? Yeah, most definitely. It's, um, it's, it's, it's not the uh, first time I've been to a, a club, but um, I look to, to get to know them as quickly as possible and um, figure out who's who and then um, look, look forward to Saturday. Great, thank you. Sean, you made an unbelievable start to your, your, your first sort of spell with Cheltenham. I think it was three goals in four games you, you, you take that again you? most definitely yeah it was, um, it was two and four at Notts County so I, you know I like to think I do do make a, a good impression to start off with and I'll be looking to do the same again and uh, if, if my performances and goals can help us um, get out of this, this situation then everybody will be happy how do you look back on that loan spell there two and a half years ago because it did start so well and then sort of petered yeah, out didn't it yeah definitely um, started really well and it was a completely different um, situation. Was in the playoffs in the end of it, but there was a, a tinge of frustration on my point of view from uh, not playing from from Christmas onwards mm -hmm. when I was in such good form. But um, you know that's in the past, and and it was great great memories. That's that's partly why I've come back because it's a great football club with good people. Yeah, did you feel you've you've sort of got unfinished business from that? I from think that so. Yeah. I'd, I'd, you know, I, I want to be here to help this football club stay in the football league, and that's that's my first thoughts. And along the way, if if I get the goals and and we we, we get out of this, 
um, we'll be better for it. Yeah. Not much sort of st- that's still around from that that time, is it? I think the Steve Elliott's probably the only one there. Yeah. The team are playing in slightly different colours. It's it's yeah, it's actually quite different. <laughs> there's um there's a few young lads from the youth team that have yeah. progressed into the first team, so you know there's there's a few familiar faces and the staff most importantly um, that have kept things together nicely here. So um, yeah, I'm looking forward to working with them. Yeah, it's 14 games to go. You, you're a striker who sort of uh, breeds of goals. You, you know, probably the next question. Have you got a target in mind that you'd like to? No, get? it's the, the, my first thoughts to get out there. You know, get them results, and if it's my goals that that help us out and. I'll, I'll be um, making the targets as and when. You have three big games coming up. Obviously, Tranmere, uh, Carlisle, Mansfield, three almost six pointers. If you, it, the sort of the, the group told you or made you aware of the of, of the importance of those next three. To be honest, when when I heard of the interest, it's the first thing I looked at, and um, I, li- I like to look as as who we're playing and, and where they are. And like you say, the massive games, and if we stay solid early on, and we can build on that. And, Hopefully get the three points. Excellent.